the topic before us is comma sense punctuate like a pro we will concentrate on the use of unnecessary commas in our sentences suppose there is two lane road there is fencing on both sides of the roads no pedestrian can cross the road from any place if we put speed breakers at different places what will happen whether there is need of speed bumps when there is fencing of road fencing on both sides of the road no these are unnecessary speed bumps in the same way if if our flow of our sentence is smooth whether we should insert commas rather they will be treated as unnecessary commas they will act as speed bumps in our writing commas are no doubt essential for clarity in writing but if we use them incorrectly it can confuse the readers and it can also make our sentences awkward one common mistake which we do which we do in our writing is the use of unnecessary commas understanding where not to place commas is just as important as knowing where they are needed it means that we should know where to use commas and where not to use commas now we will understand the aspect of unnecessary commas under the in the various situations no commas between subject and verb if i say i go to school she goes to market these are two sentences if we insert commas between subject and verb this is subject goes is a verb if we insert commas in between subject and a verb what will happen it is unnecessary the sentence will look awkward it is grammatically not correct to insert comma in between the subject and verb of a sentence other examples are my friend my friend loves to travel here again a comma in between friend and loves is unnecessary because friend is a subject and loves is a verb and comma is unnecessary the correct form correct sentence is this my friend loves to travel without a comma in between another example the team won the championship team is subject one is verb it is unnecessary comma in between it should not be there so correct sentence is the team won the championship there is no comma in between the subject and verb next is no commas between verbs and direct objects a comma should not separate a verb from its direct object she quickly grabbed the apples grabbed is a verb apple is 